Hello, brothers and sisters. I greet you in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, Yeshua HaMashiach. This is Sister Mary. Today is Saturday, September the 16th, 2017. I am very humbled to bring you the messages received today from the Holy Spirit. I am also want to give a big shout out to Brother John of That Great Day. Watchmen for That Great Day. Please go and watch his video on the final sign. And also Brother Scotty Clark. Thank you for your confirmations today. Uh, the Lord leads me in which what I should even see. And I saw both of your videos. But Brother John, yours was the last and final video out of like two, just Brother Scotty's and yours. And that was it. I said, okay, I was fixing dinner. I'm done with fixing dinner. I'm going to go and put on the word. Brother John, you have no idea what you did for me. You have no idea, but the Lord knows. So I am your sister in Christ, and I am looking forward to knowing you, brother. So I'm going to go ahead and start. So today started out pretty odd. I am um, finding a notebook that I haven't wrote in since 2016, September. And today, I am writing down Feast of Trumpets, September 23rd, 2017, Body. How odd it is that I have picked up this notebook, not completely full of writings because I have like 18 journals. Uh, just to notice that I was talking about rapture in all of this. I'm talking about rapture. Even a year ago, God is speaking to me this day. This is just me journaling. And it is Saturday. I said September 16th, 2017. And then with urgency, my spirit says very clearly, very loudly, get your house in final order. For those left behind, look how big. That means in my spirit, I know with all urgency, the Lord is saying, get it done. Get it done. For those left behind, the Holy Spirit begins to speak. To find that indeed you believe beyond a shadow of a doubt and have been shouting it from within your house that I am coming with no warning or you are spot on. I am coming, he said early morning. I am coming in an instant. You will be snatched away and carried far away from the earth. It is a birth, Scotty Clark. It is a birth of all true believers. They will be called home in the twinkling of an eye to their heavenly home in the sky. I cannot lie. You of this generation, you have sought the scriptures and often thought, Lord, are you really coming while I remain alive? Yes, my child. Yes, my child. You have been found faithful. And true, through and through, I am coming. And it is so very soon. Before noon. This is what I, I didn't understand, but I'm just going to tell you what I heard. Before noon, before the next new moon. And I'm going to read on in just a minute, but go to Brother John, the watchman for that great day, and see if he doesn't tell you the same exact date, September the 20th. That is the next new moon, September the 20th. Go ahead, look on your calendar. This is what the Holy Spirit said. Go ahead, look on your calendar. See that it's true. My words spoken to you are true and line up with Holy Scriptures. Brother John has all the Scriptures. Urgency, my child. Urgency indeed. With urgency, tell everyone I am coming to receive all who humbly believe in me, the one true King, Yeshua HaMashiach. And then a few minutes later, I heard Elohim. And now I'm going to show you something from Brother uh, Scotty Clark's video about the feast. And they are being fulfilled. And the next one is the Feast of Trumpets. Go look it up. We're in that time. Go look it up. Now later on, I heard, I know each one's fate. Do everything you can to wake them up before it's too late. With all urgency, tell everyone, each family member, I am coming, and they can no longer wait to accept me. Forgiveness awaits. Sorry, guys. Once I've come, it's too late. They will die for expressing their faith. Brother John, you said the same thing. I have knocked, I have called, I have said to all, you must confess that you're in need of a Savior, and it's me, Yeshua. I am the only one who can save you in your hour of need. I have pleaded and but all but begged, he said, all to humbly seek me while you still now, while you still can. While you still have a breath, repent, turn from all evil, lay aside all wickedness, all evil, all evil deeds in and of your flesh. Invite me in to reside. I will abide. I will abide. I will, uh, it says, I will abide with thee. 
extremely important. You must abide within me to be with me for all eternity. Trial and tribulation like you've never seen will be heaped upon everyone deceived and not believing. I am your creator. Good and evil ones fall upon your knees. Repentance is what I seek. Ask of me forgiveness. I will give it unto thee. This is the final and last plea. Yeshua, your everlasting king. And then I went and started looking up Rosh Hashanah. This is a two-day two celebration which begins on the first day of Tishri. Now, there is a message on this YouTube channel about they will be redeemed uh, in Tishri. Those left behind, you will be redeemed in Tishri. It says a two-day celebration which begins on the first day of Tishri. Tishri is the first month of the Jewish civil year, but the seventh month of the uh, ecclesiastical year. Anniversary of the creation of Adam and Eve, which is the beginning of creation. A day of judgment and coronation and sounding of the shofar. 2017 date is September the 20th. I cannot make this stuff up, guys. I cannot make it up. It is sunset September the 20th through September the 22nd. And we all know that September the 23rd is the Revelation 12 sign where uh, I believe you're going to see meteors. I believe you're going to, Satan's going to be cast down. He's already been cast to the earth, but he's going to be cast out of heaven. Okay? No more to go to and fro to blame people. Holy Spirit reminding me of a word given title that they will be redeemed on Tishri. A previous word given about the new moon that it was September the 20th. Yes, Lord, I was hearing it all. Hear my words of instruction given to you, my child. Those of you who are my bride, listen, take heed to this message. I am coming, but a few truly can sense it in their spirit. Your vessel is clean without spot or wrinkle. When I come, things on earth will never, yea, no longer remain the same. Destruction comes upon these, uh, those, he says, upon these words given by mere man, uttering peace and safety. Do go search it out. What day have they declared peace and safety? I didn't go look at it. I'm sorry, Lord. But you can go look at it. Go look at it. You are not caught up and taken away unaware. You are children of my light. You will rise before this destruct, uh, destructive day. Satan will try to get in the way, but you, I will lift quickly away. He will have utter rage and make war with anyone claiming to be a saint. Do not grow faint. A little while will go by. It go by fast. Time will feel faster than ever before. Many up on my threshing floor, I am at heaven's door. I am coming, and it is quickly. The time of repentance will quickly fade. You must no longer waver the decision of which way. Today is the day. Your redemption draws near. You need hear what the Spirit is saying. No more delaying. I am on my way. You must not. Yea, no longer can you wait. Your fate is within days, earthly days. Children, so many are left behind. Repentance will be harder to come by. For the days of my vengeance is upon them. All unrepentant, wicked, and evildoers. Uh, Satan will promise great things. He will provide food for their hunger and water to drink. All they must do is deny the one true king. Many, yea, many, I, oh my, I, he said, I think it's, I tell you, too many to count will die a martyr's death and receive a heavenly crown. You will be raised at the end of the millennial reign to live forever with your king. You shall never be tried and tempted of Satan again. You will stand before your king for eternity for not denying your faith, a truest faith uh, it will be. For you knew and was left behind to endure the most horrible things. Children, do now. Now, now, now. Now, with all urgency, what you can do for those soon left behind. For they will not come to me until they see all things coming to pass. Just like I said it would be, leave a legacy to loved ones behind, leaving them items. They will prove you knew they would need them. All prophecy is true. Through and through, I assure you, leave your homes clean and stored with much needed things. 
you are leading the blind to find me. As I will return before all is burned and is left to utter ruins, a time of wrath for repentance needed to enter my eternal kingdom, a small price to pay. Don't deny me. Don't turn away. This is for you who are left behind if you're watching after. Eternity is without end. It goes on and on. Understand this, mere men, a thousand years when I return. No resurrection till then. This is the second, a second resurrection. I'm not really sure how all this fits in, but I'm just telling you what I heard. It is the final war Satan will wage. Then he will be burned, I heard caged, and destroyed. I am the one who remains. You also will gain life eternal. Just believe and you'll see. So I'm going to sum this up. Rapture, tribulation, return to set up millennial kingdom. Because see, there has to be a rapture. Because I'm not going to go through. I'm not waiting for Jesus to come and set up his kingdom. I'm waiting for the Burma seat judgment to take place. I'm waiting to receive rewards. Uh, I'm waiting to come back on the white horse with the Lord. Okay? If I have an understanding. After this, uh, he returns and sets up the thousand year millennial kingdom. We are kings and priests, those that have already went on to be. And so the battle with Satan is after that thousand years because he's going to, Satan will be released again. Okay? And he will tempt and try all of those. That's why if you die a martyr's crown, you're not going to be tempted and tried again. Or a martyr's death, I'm sorry. The battle with Satan. After that, it's the great white throne judgment. And it's for eternity in heaven or in hell. God bless you, brothers and sisters. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. All of those that are righteous, you're ready to go. Be ready. Just, this is it. Get your house in order. Uh, leave your jobs in order. Leave your bills in order. And be ready to go. And if you're watching this video today, you're not repentant before a holy God. Repent. 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 That's all I can say. Turn to the Lord right now while you still have breath in your body. God bless you.